Well, somebody reminded me that I didn't have a water feature in the garden. Now, you all know that I really don't like doing normal things. Um, so here's my water feature. It's in an IBC tank. It's under the leaves of the acacia tree. And I'm not going to freak out about the flowers dropping in there because that'll be a good thing, I think. Okay, so... First of all, I'll show you the, the, oh, yeah, I'll tell you what's in here. There's actually tadpoles in here. I got the, paid the local kids to go out and find me some tadpoles of various sizes. And there's about 50 or 60 of them in here. Yeah, none of them down this end by the look of it. Oh, yeah, there's one. Okay. And then... So I filled up this half an IBC, so it's 500 litres, I suppose. Anyway, this one has got the tap on the bottom, so I'll be able to empty some out. How I'm going to do that without the tadpoles getting out, I'm not quite sure yet. That's a, some, that won't happen for a while yet. Anyway, this is first of all, this is the frog raft. There's some pieces of wood that I've tied together with a um, with pieces of torn up sheet and the kind of idea is see how the ends of it are on here the idea is we'll leave them in there and later on when the tadpoles turn into frogs and then they turn into ones that can um, you know lay eggs which is uh, quite a few weeks away yet but they might just use I've I've got another few that I've got that I've you know torn up and made tied both ends and twisted it and stuff like that. They might just use those for their eggs. Or they won't, one or the other. But my thinking with this is that um, the stuff that's on the top is not so much for the tadpoles, but it's for the insects that might want to come and have a drink. So they can sit on here and and have have a drink or they might want to as this stuff starts rotting because I only made this yesterday as this stuff starts rotting um, insects will probably be attracted to it too and if we like I know they will be because the mozzies if nothing else will lay their eggs in there <laughs> it's just spud being Anyway, um, he's heard something. Anyway, um, yeah, there's a log over there. Uh, that one. That's one of the ones that um, grew turkey tail mushrooms. And that all died back. But putting it in there has actually given them a bit of life. But the mycelium from them will make sure that I don't know, make sure something is healthy. And none of the things that are in here, the, the, there's a pond weed. Which is not quite the one I wanted, but never mind. We'll see what happens with this one. Um, everything that's, all the leaves that are in here, like these pumpkin leaves and leaves off brassicas and a little bit of dried horse poo over there. All sorts of stuff. And then, of course, it's covered with that netting, generally. Um, yeah, but it'll make a kind of a very weak compost tea, all that stuff. Or weed tea, or whatever you want to call it. I actually dropped some compost in here, too. But it's all sunk now. And, um, so I can take out a couple of bucketfuls and, um... Put them on the strawberries and tomatoes and stuff that's growing in these other IBC tanks. Or I can pick stuff from there and put it in here. So, um, yeah, but so I've got a water feature. I don't need bubbles or trickles or anything. Although you never know what I'll come up with. Um, but in the meantime, we've got a, a um, what do you call it? A tadpole habitat, which will turn into... A frog habitat and when the frogs start jumping around the chook pen's not too far away so um, 
that'll probably cut down the population quite a bit. <laughs> oh, and also there's the um, the turtles. They'll um, they might score the odd the odd um, tadpole. We'll see. I'm trying to think where I could put the turtle. Like I want to make it. This was an experiment, and I'm trying to think where I might put one for the turtles. Nice big tank. Again, I can just take out a few bucketfuls of the water a day and put in some new water and they live a pretty nice life. I could, you know, lower the level of the water even and put some rocks in it so they have a basking rock and stuff like that. But yeah, version one of a turtle tank. Catch you later.